that's me? Yeah. Oh. We are? <laughs> oh. <laughs> Hello, everybody. Hello. Hi. Thank you for coming. Oh, my God. We just sat and ate and kind of full and kind of garlicky bread. <laughs> but we're going we're gonna to move on. My name is Shalina Smith, and I am the owner of All Hustle No Luck Records. I started my business of about maybe eight years ago. I started off as an A&R for artists. Um, I have the passion for music and all that stuff because I can't sing, <laughs> I can't dance, but I always knew I wanted to do something in the business because my dad was a DJ. So I grew up with my dad being a house DJ out here in Richmond. So he would go to the club that's way gone now, it's called the Candlelight, and he would spin records there and I would pick uh, help my dad pick records for the day, for for his night. So I know all about Lakeside and, and, <laughs> and, and Commodores and all of those, you know, bands um, and the SOS band. I, so I just love music. So when I was growing up, I said, Dad, I want to be an artist. He was like, Shalane, you can't sing. Oh, yeah, I know. <laughs> but I knew I wanted to do something. So it fell. The opportunity fell in my lap, where I had a um, a, a partner where we got together and started a rap group and we started that way, touring and everything else. Um, got to some um, good success about that. Um, my uh, partner decided she wanted to do something else, so I took that upon myself to start my own um, record label. So that's what I do now. Um, I'm partnered with um, R&B uh, group, uh, Tony, 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 Dwayne Wiggins. And he does Monday night sessions, live bands, um, comedy, spoken word, if you play the spoons, anything you do, he doesn't <laughs> care. You can go in and sign up and you can make that happen. So that's what I do. I'm glad to be around a lot of artists, a lot of uh, creatives. Um, you guys inspire me. I was talking about earlier how this business is so hard. You get a lot of criticism, you, uh, sleepless nights, lost relationships, you know, boyfriends, wives, you know, whatever, you know, you lose those. But somehow you just keep going because it's, you know you have a gift and you know this is what you want to do. And I advise don't let nobody tell you what you can't and cannot do. Just keep on pushing. So today we're here for the nominees of our Music Block TV. So a little bit about Music Block TV. It was a cable access show that was um, aired bi-weekly um, on BCM. So that's Berkeley uh, Community Music Station. I think that was Channel 28. Um, so they decided to um, bring that live. They played music videos, they did live performances and things of that sort. So now they actually um, bring everybody forth, and then that's where they get the nominate nominations and the awards and things of that sort. So we have a musical rendition of something we're going to get from uh, <laughs> Kate right now, and I want to start with her. And Kate, why don't you just come in right. the, and tell us about yourself. Hi, everybody. Thank you so much. It's a pleasure to be here with you and to get to know you today. Uh, my name is Kate Magdalena, and um, I have one, you know, I, I can play one or two songs for you, oh, but, yeah, you but I'll start with my song, Streets of Any Town. And this, this is a song about the homeless. This is a song about, you know, it's like, as someone that hasn't been homeless, to see the people that are homeless and to feel like, what is our society doing about it? And is it okay to have people that are homeless that don't want to be? You know, some people choose to be for whatever reason. And, I, I can respect that, you know? And of course, but, but if there's a way to help people in our society in a way that is cost-effective, humane, um, and out of the love of God, you know, to how can we really care for each other, that's what it's all about. So this song is called Streets of Any Town. And feel free to clap.
So that thank you so much. Thank you very much. So next we have some of the nominations that actually for the folks that's not here. <laughs> uh, I don't want to call y'all because y'all spoke. We can anyway, still call them out. yeah, <laughs> we said still call them out. And where is um, the the uh, paper? Yeah, I think it's back here. Okay, so do we know what uh, category these? No, they're just the name. Okay, so these are um, some nominees that did not make it today. Um, the way we the way we pick these is, you know, we by the uh, by the performances. I see a, a lot actually a lot of people that I've worked with in the past actually. Um, and oh, I think we got Tim B. Sports and Tim. Oh, okay. I work with him too. So these are a lot of people that I've worked with in the past um, coming um, up um, through this 
hard artistry, you know, that we decided, uh, actually with that we were actually called to, because I think we are called uh, for this industry. So let's get this started. Uh, we have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, five, about nine people. Um, Arthur J. is one of the nom uh, nominees. We have Stat Game, Kenny Sawyer, Pack Heat, Studio, I remember them from last year. Yeah. Yeah, Tiffany Love, I remember her from last year also. And V1CTV and Town Biz Sports and Entertainment. And then we have some names that i never seen before, <laughs> that's good. We have Tania Hill, T Local, Capital B, Ali Cocaine, Rocky Bad, Girls in the Hood, Molly Brazzy, I know her, Ticket uh, TV, Sports Talk, and Blue Blood Boxing TV. That's something new. <laughs> see, they'll see. Hey. <laughs> but y'all need to be here. <laughs> so, um, what we have up next? Uh, I guess these are the ones that were supposed to be here, I think. The, uh, oh, these are. Let's see. <laughs> so y'all can see what they're doing in there. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> see what, now, the people that were supposed to be here. Guys are doing great. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go ahead and do this. So I'm, you're gonna get a harassing call off like this. Um, <laughs> <laughs> that was Arthur J. Oh, Arthur J. I think, I think we did all of these. These are the people that. Oh, Ali Moore X. Girl, you ain't here. <laughs> <laughs> harassing call. Oh, fluid. See, bro. See. Uh -huh. <laughs> harassing call. I know him. Um, I'm gonna take all the these home. <laughs> see, you're not even see playing with my emotions. See, come on, people. And Derek Fay, mm. <laughs> harassing call. <laughs> <laughs> what I want to do next is actually ask Sharon to come up, or maybe you can turn the camera on. I want her to actually talk about her um her journey with her and her sisters uh teaching um music and being in the music industry as something to give uh, a gift to uh the upcoming artists that we see is coming up anything that comes off the head turn it around because i don't think she can get up okay, I can't really yeah As I mentioned earlier, we are honored to have been former recipients of the Trailblazer Award. And it is, it's because we're old. <laughs> we were the Manuel sisters and still remain the Manuel sisters, but we performed in the Bay Area when we were like in college, and right after high school and like that, and enjoyed bringing spiritual as into the field of gospel music where we sort of extended a lot of programs by adding something a little bit different as we were all in college at the same time getting our degrees and becoming teachers. We love music and it's an important part of our lives and I know that without music I wouldn't have had my teaching career and so it's like I'm glad to be here to honor people who are trying to use music to better the world. And that's, that is always valid. And this is a chance to honor some people who otherwise don't get noticed, but who in our community we appreciate. So it is my honor to acknowledge the fourth annual Music Block TV Award nominees who are present. Yes. <laughs> yes. We're going to honor <laughs> And so it is my honor to congratulate Kate Magdalena. Thank you. Yes, Kate. Thank you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. You're wonderful. And Ives. Thank you. 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 Thank you.
Yes, go ahead. Go ahead. I'm one of the manual sisters as well. I'm her twin. Oh. oh. And I wanted to mention that we didn't just stumble into music. We had a musical family. My mother loved to sing. She would play the piano and sing at any church at the drop of a hat. She played by ear. And she didn't want us to. She wanted us to study and be musicians of a different kind. I regret she felt that way because even though reading music means a whole lot, studying music means a whole lot, but the gift of music is even more. And I think that in our coming up, we didn't get to appreciate the gift. And what is so wonderful is that we are now seeing you with the gift and knowing you have the gift and pursuing that gift. And that means a lot. Mm -hmm. That means a whole lot. Our aunt-in-law was one of the first librarians, black librarians, in the city of Oakland. She was an inspiration. She taught piano lessons at her house, even after her fingers were bent with crystalline arthritis. That doorbell rang, that student came up, and she just as quietly and patiently taught those students without a ruler. She let them develop their skills. Yes. And so I wanted to just mention, we weren't the first trailblazers. We had parents and other relatives blazing the trail for us. And so hopefully you can see that you're trailblazing for the next generation. And everything you do is going to count in the next generation. Whether they realize it or not, they're going to look at you one day and say, oh, that old fashioned music. <laughs> yes. <laughs> because theirs is going to be different. And that's just all I wanted to cover. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to come on. <laughs> Me again. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> See, the sisters dropped a lot of gems. Dropped a lot of gems for us, uh, for us upcoming artists. And in closing, I just want to say, look forward to the uh, actual awards um, coming up. August 7th. It's August 7th. It's going to be so fun. Yes, mm. y'all yeah, better come. Cause <laughs> yeah, this so. year. <laughs> hey, let's just tell, why don't we all get get here together? Let's just tell them we want you to come. Yes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just don't, <laughs> we want you to come. We this want you to come. The this fourth is annual, the fourth my annual. music black you gotta TV be there. Awards. Be there or be square. Be there or be square. <laughs> August <calling>. seven. <laughs> Thank y'all for it's coming out. Fun. Thank y'all for right, coming thank out. You. And that's it. <laughs> Bye. Thank Bye. you. Bye. Yay. Thank you. Bye. <laughs> that was awesome. Thank you. Thank you. You know the really amazing thing? Listen to this. White girl grows up in New York City, Park Avenue. Never got.